everybody, my name's Car on Fire and welcome to Small Land. Do you wish to get yourself some pets that are going to be absolutely great for your gameplay? Well, this is one pet in particular I can absolutely recommend. However, you cannot get it until you beat the game. And this requires you to find the clover key and give it to the elder to be able to get the treat from the elder. This requires you to get far enough in the story to kill the king stag beetle in the castle island and then once you've done that you can deliver it to the elder and you'll get your very own recipe for your damselfly. Once you've gotten this recipe though all you'll need is a stone oven and in this stone oven you need to make the damselfly treat which requires firefly juice petals and seed oil. Seed oil gotten from seeds, petals gotten from flowers, and firefly juice, well, gotten from fireflies, which can be located either in the sewers up by Nock and the Black Hornet, or you can go to, there's a little island just down here on the beach where you can find some at night time. Uh, you will need to look at night time for the fireflies. Once you've got these items though, you can make the treat and then all you need to do is locate a damselfly. Now don't make a mistake like me and have a prior mount because if you have prior mounts, you cannot tame another mount in this version of the game. You can only have one mount at a time, so bear that in mind, it won't let you tame anything else if you have an active mount already. To find the damselfly, I think the easiest area to get them, honestly, is by this fallen over log. And then on the opposite side, there's a bunch of lily pads with flowers. You can find another one that gets quite close to the lily pads and you just wait for it to come down a bit. And like everything else is tamed in the game, all you need to do is damage the damselfly to about a quarter health. And then you can feed it the treat and you'll immediately be able to fly around and ride on it. And at the moment, there's actually a really interesting stamina bug, which is actually uh, pretty bad. So we just use mine, for example, right here. So I've got my damselfly. We will mount it. And then we want to just keep ascending. And you can see his stamina drains really fast. But if you hit spacebar again, once it fully runs out, you can forever fly as long as you're holding down spacebar. But if you want it to go back down again, you just, you know, start it up again. So you keep tapping space bar and if you run out of stamina again you just need to tap a space bar again and it will keep going infinitely if you catch it just right there we go i got it and i just hold down space bar and keep going i actually flew up my entire tree house on the damselfly because of this bug which i feel like you should be able to fly you know this long and not have such a short stamina pull uh, I feel like it makes them more worth it than they are because with the stamina they have right now they're not exactly great. They can pass riverways but they're not fantastic but with the infinite stamina it definitely feels like a very fitting final reward that you get. I love the damselfly and once you guys get one I hope you have best of luck getting one and uh, hopefully it will help you out. They are 100% worth it, I really like them and uh, this damselfly is going to be hanging out with me now. Anyways, I hope this damselfly video helped you out on taming your very own damselfly. It's easy like the other tames once you get the hang of it. The main mission for this one is just to kill the stag beetle boss itself and get that clover key to the elder. So that's all you need to do and the elder will give you the recipes and then you just make it. So there you go. Hopefully this helps you. And uh, if you want to see any more taming videos, let me know. And uh, thank you for watching. I love you and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.